Hello guys, welcome back to Let's Play Banjo Kazooie! Alright, let's continue down into this hole. Go down the hole. And I'm not sure what's next, honestly. Oh, uh, there's golden feathers in there. We don't need those really, because we're gonna get a bunch later. Um keep flapping your way up there, Banjo. Alright, the next hole you see over here is I think it just goes through. I think there might be a Jinjo in there or something though. I don't think there's any actual rooms left on the outskirts. I think it's all just the rest is inside of Clinker. Yes, we're going inside the garbage disposal. Yeah, I was right. It's a Jinjo. And we only need one Jinjo left and I know exactly where that is. So that's cool. Oh. Did I just go in a circle? Oh, yeah, you do go in a circle. Oh well. Okay. I guess I could have gone and I guess there was a hole before that, but whatevs. And, and then I think in this one, I actually honestly don't know what's in here. Oh, you can book them. Nothing really essential to this. Oh my god! I'm running out of air. I'm running out of air. Oh my god. Go, Banjo, go. Probably shouldn't have just kept continuing. Like a smarty. Um, I guess I could go over here and see what's in here and get the... I don't think there's anything. Okay. Um, the rest of the things that we're going to do is on the outskirts of... that's not underwater. I don't... yeah, there's still no rooms, but there's still a bunch of things on the outskirts. Let's kill this guy and just release all those honeycombs, I guess, if I need them later. Don't see where I will need them, but... And then in my last LP, I had a lot of trouble with this, but that's because I was on an emulator, and it's really difficult to navigate with that. So... I think, honestly, eventually I just cheated and used a save, and used a save state, honestly. Because I was just annoyed with it. It was getting obnoxious. Why am I still doing this? I don't need to. <laughs> I forgot what was over there. What did I get? Was an extra life? Oh, it was just a bunch of notes. And then an extra life. Nothing really is, you know, um, important. And then down here, there's going to be these tubes. I think in this very long tube, there's going to be a couple of notes in here. So that's going to be important to grab, which I should have gotten probably when I was over here. And then I miss, of course. Because I'm awesome at this game. And that, and if you're not awesome if you don't miss things. You know you're, you're, you're not good if you just get everything. You have to miss things. That's how you know you're really good. Mm-hmm. Okay. And, ah... Uh, don't miss any and die. That'd be awesome. Thank you, Banjo. It's always Banjo's fault. It's never my fault if I do something wrong. It's always Banjo's fault. Just remember that, guys. It's just Banjo. He fucking sucks. Alright. Oh, wait till he... There's multiple ways to get up and onto... <laughs> Ew, that's gross. That's so gross. I can stand in his eyeball and it just kind of follows me. Ew, it like turns and everything. That's so gross. <sighs> I'm gonna make him cross-eyed. Deep, deep, derp, derp, derp. What about it? <laughs> Schmear. <laughs> okay. Now that I'm done derping around there. Jesus. Okay. So what you're gonna wanna do is climb up here. And then... I think... You can just kind of hit it. Yeah. And it'll open. <laughs> It's not really hard. You just kind of hit the cage and it's like, okay, I'll open. What, what, whatever you want. All right, so land down here and there's a couple notes over here. If Of course I miss it. And then a beacon bokum and um, the guy forgot what his name is. We're going to call him Charlie. That's his name. He's Charlie. They're the Charlies of the world. And I guess once the credits roll, we'll figure out what his real name is. But for now, he's Charlie. All right. So, um, I guess there's still one more thing that we got to do out here before we go actually inside of Clanker. So that's gonna be climbing back on, climbing, climbing back on top of them, and see that bolt that just flew down. Stand on it, and we're gonna go for a ride in three, two, one. Oh, I thought I was gonna time it really well, and I was gonna say blast off and everything. Oh well. No! Ah! 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 Land on him again. Land on him again. Woo! 
Oh, good job. All right, the bolt's still up there. All right, let's time this better this time. All right, blast off in three, two, one. Pew! Aw. Whatever. I give up. All right, let's just try going slowly again. So that worked gloriously last time. All right, magnificent. And grab the jiggy. And we are actually done with the outside world of Clinker's Cavern. So that's good, I guess. And, oh, wow, you would get hurt, Banjo, you douche. All right, wait until this bolt actually flies up this time, and then you can go inside. I thought, I thought that was pretty cool what they did with that. <gasps> it's time to have sex. Smash the witch. And then her eyes pop out. That's cool. Uh, I don't actually need the move to get through here. I'm too cool for that. But it's still pretty smart to actually have it, because you'll probably get hurt like that. Uh, but it's pretty easy to navigate through here. See? And I win. Um, let's see. What's back there? There's two holes to go through. Um, I think this leads, I don't know where this leads you. Dang it. Oh, okay, this is where I wanted to be. Cool. Alright. Um, I don't want to do that yet. We're going to fly through here. And hit this. And go through the hole. Still flying. But we'll come out walking. Alright, and, uh-oh. Um, I don't think I can get past all these razors. Uh, I think we're gonna have to go back. Oh, just kidding, here's Bottles. Hi, Bottles. Alright, this moves me deep, 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 deep. It's invulnerability wings, basically. Or not wings, but, yeah. With golden, uh, feathers, you'll be able to just be invincible, pretty much. But you can only hold, uh... 10 at a time, so that kind of sucks. And then bottles will fill up my one life meter that I need. And then that's the rest of the moves. I was never able to uh, find this move as a kid either. I guess th that's basically why I hated this place so much, just because I could never find anything. I couldn't 100% it, and I just, I, I sucked. I sucked. That's as best as I can describe it. I wasn't good at the game. <laughs> So yeah, you just press Z, and then the- Oh god! Too early! <laughs> um, yay, fail. Uh, I'm gonna have to pick up my sister soon, dang it. Um, I guess after I do this little mini-game here, I'll do it. Um, I forgot where I was going. That's gonna happen a lot. <laughs> Alright, so basically in this mini-game here, you jump through all the green rings, and you have a time limit. So let's get started. I should be able to do okay. Why did I just do that? That was stupid of me. Oh, well. Oh, well, stay underwater then if you're going to do that, Chelsea. Jeez, stupid. All right, and then this one, get up on top of the, you get up on top of the box, and you do a little flippy flip, and you barely make it over. Go underwater again. Go through this ring. We should be fine. Yeah, we'll be perfectly fine. We have 20 seconds left. Get up on top of the box and then fly through this one, then this one. And then just kind of flap your way over there. Go underwater and look out for the... I forgot what it was called. Swisper or something? I don't know. But you go through the last green ring with 9 seconds to spare. And the water level raises and you get a jiggy. So we're going to grab that. Ah! Get up there. Get up there. There you go. Stupid. Alright, so sorry for this being kind of a short part, but I have to go pick up my sister, and she's going to get pretty mad at me for not being there. I mean, we're almost pretty much done. So, I guess in the next part, we're going to finish up Clinker's Cavern and then head on to the next world. So, I'll see you guys then. This has been Chelsea. See you guys later. Bye.